I've always loved playing Soccer Aid, but this year, I went out to Cambodia's capital, Phnom Penh, to see how the money we raise is helping children. Some areas of this city are extremely tough places for kids to grow up. And this is one of the toughest. Violent crime and drug use are common here. This is a scary place to be a child. In this community, it has about 300 families and about 600 children and youths. 600? Yeah, wow. it's about that. Around here is a drug area, oh, a lot of dealers. How dangerous is it for kids? It's really dangerous for them. This train is coming. It is quick. What I find shocking is how accessible I've been told like drugs are. And we're always told as kids, do not go on the railway. It's one of the most dangerous places. And this is their playground. How do kids have a chance? One of the children who lives here with his family, right beside the train track, is Tira. This is where he's lived his whole life. What are these here? Footballers. Ronaldo. Yeah. Favourite player? Yeah. Yeah. Do you ever feel afraid living here? <laughs> What do you hope for in the future? For Tira, the most important thing is to complete his education. UNICEF supports a safe space here where children can play and learn safely away from the dangers outside. A safe place to play and learn. It's not a lot to ask, is it? But for children like Tira, living in dangerous places like this, everything is just so much harder. You know what it's like to be a kid. It's meant to be fun. It's not meant to be scary. He is a kid with a twinkle in his eye. You can tell he's just a kind soul. Hey! Ah! Soccer Aid, for me, now doesn't mean a game of football. It means education, it means safety, and it means chance. It's everyday life for these kids, and uh, it's unfair. So unfair. I can't really explain the emotions. I'm not, I feel angry because kids shouldn't be living like this. And I also feel like we need to be doing more. Please, please, please donate. Honestly, it means the world.